What's up guys? So, we have a Tahoe. We are gonna change the oil on it. I think it's a 5.3 liter, which is an LS motor. If I'm not, it looks just like an LS motor underneath it. I mean, if you look like the the gas intake manifold or the um, whatever the God, it's been a long day. Sorry guys. Uh, whatever. This is the head valve cover. Okay, when you look at the valve cover, it looks like an LS under this plastic thing. It looks like an LS truck uh, intake manifold. So I'm gonna guess this thing has a, probably an LS1 is what I would say it is. It's an iron block aluminum head. Hey. Uh, Destiny is gonna show you guys the inside of it. Yes. Hold on, let me collapse. Okay. Oh, actually, no. I'll just give you a little selfie stick. Take it off the tripod here. Okay, but um, be careful, okay? So the camera don't fall out of this little hoopty holder. Okay. Okay. Um, Okay. Keep it steady. Make sure you're looking at that so you're actually showing them something. You're not just looking at the ground. Okay? Oh. Not that you don't do that. Hey. <laughs> Dust them shoes off before you get my casa. <laughs> oh, yeah, and try to keep the camera back because there's no wide angle lens on that thing, so they have to be able to see it, you see? Uh -huh. Alright, go for it. And then I'll take them on an oil change. Okay, so here's the seats are really nice. No? Well, just. Okay, so I'm just going to throw my car seat in the back there. <laughs> Close the store. Let me take a quick little look. So nice! Sorry guys, can't close my door. Okay, so it is so nice. Look, when the car is turned on, so wide it was well, like, so you could go, you go like that, and then you pick one of those, and then pick one of those, add it there, and then go here, the steering wheel. It smells amazing, because we went to the store and got some stuff for this video. Got that. Oh, it smells so good. And this seat. I don't know if it's the same with the other one, but this is amazing. Okay. So, uh, hold on. Let me open the door. Okay. So, guys. Look. See all these? This one, so I'm going to try this one. That and then that. So this goes down and up. And then the next one, this one, right here, leans back. Watch. Moves. If you look at the seat belt, you can actually tell. Watch. Oh, sorry. I see. see? And then. Yeah, it leans back. And it's amazing. And like, I love it. And this. Yeah. And then. All these back hands. Yes. Okay, it's just amazing in this car. You can control. Air comes out of here. Either just me or it <laughs> seems like it's coming out. But, yeah, that. And this one. Oh. Watch. It's amazing. There, there, and right there. Right there. 
and watch this, guys. Back seats! Oh. Now, let me get back here. Will you just climb over? Oh, forgot something. Actually, forgot two things. This. Whoa. Opens. Okay. Well, it cup holders. Oh, there you go. See? Cup holders. And then we close that up and don't want it right there. Opens right there. Ta da! And then over there, yeah. Over here is basically like normal stuff. I'm grabbing my magic mirror for you guys. Yeah. There you go. Magic mirror. I made it. Just that part of the car. And this part is amazing. Look. Lock. Unlock. Oh, unlock. Lock. Roll down windows. Heated seats. And then. That. Then. What you do is you pull that. You pull it. Push it. Yeah. Basically pull it and push it. Watch. So what you do is you go like that. Yeah. Now I'm going to keep the door closed. Now. Oh, and you put headphones in there. We haven't really messed around with the car too much. I wish we did. You just climb over the hat. Just climb over this. So easy. And then, yeah, yeah. this is my magic mirror. Okay. Well, I won't leave on the seat when the window is rolled down. So. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry. But I had to climb over. Now, this is actually really cool. <sighs> That opens up. Okay. There you go for a second. Okay. Eh. Okay. Now, I put my mirror in there. My mirror. What you do is you push this button and lift up. Unless you just want to lift your choice. And then, yeah. These seats move forward. This part moves forward and then they fold up. Yeah. But I'm going to throw my car seat back there. So yeah. There you go. Back. There, you could see. There's a little lot of room back there. I thought it was tiny. No wonder I could fit back there. <laughs> okay, well, I can see if I fit back there, guys. It's so funny. So, yeah. I could fit back there. Yeah, just about. And, yeah. So, Cup holders. This is really cool. This seatbelt thing. You adjust it. Been trying to do that. Well, I'm probably not going to be in the rest of the video. So, yeah. Let me see. All right, guys. So, I pulled the drain plug. I thought I had no oil, but it turns out it does have oil. And it was pretty good too. It looked like it came out. I could see through the oil. It wasn't black or nothing. It was like a, you know, just a brownish tinge. Probably looks like it had a, you know, a hundred miles on it. So, I don't know. I mean, you look underneath this thing and it's not leaking oil or nothing. Oh, Jesus. anti -sleep. Um, you can see, you know, like when you look under some cars, there's oil everywhere. Oh, my sister's little Honda is like that. 
just oil all over the whole dang thing. You know, it looks like it just wasn't well made taken care of. Uh, but you look under it, I'll show you guys if we can see, and it's just nice. You know, there's not oil everywhere. It just looks like it was well made, well taken care of. Engine oil, it's easy to get to. So can you guys see that? There's the, the transfer case. Look at that. No oil on the transfer case. No leaks. Nothing. Uh, drive shafts in the front are nice. The lift kit I want to get puts a spacer block in between the drive shaft right here. Um, right here, actually. A spacer block in between there. And then it gives you new knuckles. It's a rough country one. Oh, I can't wait to do that. Look at the oil, though. Can you guys see that? Hold on. That's not bad oil. You can see it on camera. That's good oil. So I might dump that back in or uh, put my new oil. Well, I'll, actually, I'll just put my new oil in. And then if five quarts isn't enough, I'll add a little of this one. I'm actually just going to put the plug in it now because it doesn't need to be drained all the way. I don't even think it needs a filter on it. It just looks like it's in good shape, man. This thing's got low miles though for what it is. I don't know why it has such low miles. It's very strange that a car this old has that low of miles. Um, I do want to change the oil and the diffs though because God knows when that's been done. I'm not going to do that today, but I am going to do that soon. i got to look it up on our lovely YouTube um, so I can do that. I can see a drain plug right there. Oh wait, that's not a drain plug, is it? Oh yeah, it is. And there's a fill plug. So I guess that's probably just how you do it. It's pretty simple. Most of them are like that. Fill it till it runs out, basically. So this is our front diff. Got that drive shaft going to it. This is a nice car, man. Look at the exhaust. This is, God, this is a nice car. Transmission pan, no oil leaking around that. As long as it's been taken care of and I can continue to take care of it, it should go freaking, you know. The only thing I don't like is that power steering. It's looking kind of crusty, but it should, you know, some of these had 240,000 miles on them. Yeah, it's like 240,000 miles is so much. Destiny, you okay, babe? Yeah. Oh, that's a nice way. Push it over there. Take my 15. It's a 15 for the oil drain, you guys. That's right. There, that's a 15. I couldn't find the size because I've never worked on this. This is the first time, you know. Hopefully, I'll have many more oil changes on it. That'd be awesome. I really like it. There's a torsion bar. And I guess the lift kit I want to get. You know how some lift kits, you can see that torsion bar sticking out underneath the vehicle, which I think is cool, you know, it's not like I'm this four-wheeling champion. I actually wouldn't mind having that, but the lift kit I want to get has a no-drop torsion, so you don't, you don't have to drop your torsion bars, which I don't carry the way. Tiny drain plug. Ugh. I always use a little wrench so I don't strip it. I learned my lesson a long time ago with stuff like that. Because I'll strip everything out. Oh, my legs. Oh, sorry, guys. Okay, so, let's see. What is this? Oh, it's worn out, though. Oh, it's the over-travel mounts. Can you guys see that? Oh, let's see if I can. So, it's right here. So, right there. See that little bushing? It bashes into this when this compresses too much. Those are kind of worn out a little. And then also what I heard this vehicle has is it's got air shocks in the rear. So if you get like a load on the back, it'll automatically pump it up. So that's awesome. All right, let's see here. Here, you want to grab the camera? Okay. All right, so I can tighten that bolt. And I'm going to show them the oil. Okay. Here's my magic mirror. Don't be videotaping my legs.
Huh? What else do I videotape? Not my legs. Me just going like that? Come on, let's videotape this thing. Okay. Do you need this? Funky looking oil. Why does it look like that? I don't know. I thought it looked clean. Let me get a rag. Don't put that too much. It might fall in. Just, you know, let me get this white rag here. Then we'll dip it in there. I mean, that's what it looks like, guys. Kind of stinks. It looks new, but it kind of smells like it's been sitting. I don't know, that looks like cheap oil to me. We'll see when we pour the new one out what it looks like, you guys. I got castor oil, high mileage. <coughs> that looks like five quarts that I took out just there, so it probably takes five quarts or so. Two. Oh, hey. Hmm? Do you need it on the camera? Oh, on the stand? Yeah. You don't want to hold it no more? You don't want to be my camera woman? She's so like obsessed with playing inside this car. <laughs> hey, you take the air pressure, you put it in your room, not in the car. Or you can put it in the Subaru, that one. So, and I checked the tranny fluid, guys. This is what the tranny fluid looks like. This Tahoe, it has 140,000 miles on it. Can you believe that? My Subaru has less miles than that. Look at that, nice pink color. Doesn't smell burnt, look at that. You can see it on the rag. Nice pink color. Oh, smells sweet, but do not eat. Huh? So if I am correct, I might be wrong if someone could tell me, this is the early generation of like the LS motors. LS1s is what they would call this. It looks just like it, so I don't know. You know, I never had one though. I always just go off of what I see on TV. Basically, we're gonna pull the air filter too. That'll be a good sign if it's been taken care of. If that's filthy, but the oil was nice, so I don't know. I got an oil filter for it, but I don't. I'm like half tempted not even put the damn thing on right now. Can I go put this in the? Oh man. Um. Yeah, but it's locked. You know, maybe I'll just save it. And um. I don't know. Let's see which one is under there. If it's a Fram, I'll put that one on because Frams are shitty. I mean, poopy. Sorry. God, I got it stuff. I've been doing so good, you guys. Like, I haven't said, like, cuss words or nothing. Not just in videos, but just in life. Like, just bad, you know. I'm a single dad, basically, and I cuss. That's not good. So I've been doing good. I've been stopping not saying it. No cussing. Bad words are not allowed in this house, huh? That's right. Good girl. You good girl. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to check that oil filter. If it's a Fram, I'm going to put that one on, and then I'll come back with you. All right, guys, so I couldn't get that. It was a Fram, so I changed it. But I couldn't get the oil filter off. And then I was gold panning for oil because it started dripping hella oil, or I mean, hecka oil, excuse me, out of that when I stabbed a screwdriver through it. If you can never get these off, guys, see how there's a screwdriver hole in it? Um, you can always ram a screwdriver through it and use that to twist it off. I almost do that every time anyways. But, so, unless, you know, if it's really tight, I guess the people who changed it, it was probably one of those goofy lube places and they uh, you know, tightened it on with a three million pound per inch impact gun. So, um, yeah, so that's that. So that's oil out, new filter in. The one I got was a wick, now it's a Fram. The wick one's better. <coughs> that is the Ultra Guard though, but still. And then, Drain plugs in, so yeah, it's time to pour oil in, you guys. Yes, the money shot. Okay, let's see. I always thought, you know, if this car ever something happened to it, got hit or something, it, it it's still an LS, right? So it's still worth something to somebody, like even myself, perhaps. So I got about three million filters, but I bought another one because look at the mouth on that one. Jeez. That's, that's a, built for an LS, look. Oh, that's a V8 filter. Only the four cylinder ones have the small mouth. Let's see, do I have a four cylinder? See, look, that's a four cylinder one there. That too, this one's puking. That one too, and this, I got this one. This one's only for V8s. V8 
V8 filter. I need a Sharpie. Okay, let me collapse this tripod. Okay, okay, yeah, mm -hmm, yeah. Oh, no. You did not just break on me, did you? Did you break? Your magic who? What'd you say about my mom? What? No. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You showed me the magic mirror. Yeah, I love it. It's awesome. It's a magic mirror. Yeah, I know. Duh. Of course. Set the shot up, guys. Take your long for that. Maybe I shouldn't, but I am. Oh yeah. I'm gonna do some sick pour action with the V8 only air or uh, oil filter. Oil funnel. Go do what? <laughs> I don't know what it is. No, no. Show me. What? Show me your mi magic mirror. I was asking you where it is. Oh no, I don't know where it is. No. Maybe it'll. It's calling for you. Mirror, mirror, on the paper. Where's it at? Oh, I can't. Oh no. Ah. No. Sister is rude now. She's like, I told her, she's like, let me use your laptop. She's like, can I have it back? I see you got your car. Like, rude like. Like, it's really a rude. Lot of really cool it sucks. Stuff. I didn't even use the thing, anyways, the whole time I had it, because you can't use it for YouTube or anything. And, I mean, you can, but it's just, my phone does better. So. I don't know, I just kind of thought she was rude about it. Maybe she wasn't, though. Maybe it's just me being oversensitive. Ugh. This V8 filter's no good. This V8 funnel's no good. How do they... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You guys see that goodness? Look at that. Look at that. That's straight up. You could never pour it this fast in the Subaru. And I can't use this funnel on the Subaru either because it's only for V8s. I said so. This yellow funnel? Oh, that we got? Yeah, it's only for V8s. Why? Um, that's the rules. That's what, that's how, that's what the st look, sticker says. V8 only. Now, I wish I could use it on the other car, but I just can't. I got a, a smaller one that'll fit it just fine. What is this hoopty thing? Oh, for the... Oh, that's a surge tank? Hmm, I never had a car with a surge tank. Oh, yeah, I did. I had a Ford Focus once had a surge tank. Are you done using the car as a jungle gym? That... Oh! Oh, it's still kind of didn't. It's got like this little thing here. You can put that in there. That's kind of nice, man. It's nice, nice. Oh, wait, maybe this way. <gasps> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So my sister's making YouTube videos now. Do you guys want to know what I think about that? Sick. Everyone should make YouTube videos. You don't get nothing for them. I've made so many videos and for a long time and I think I made like five bucks or ten bucks or something. It's, you don't get nothing for them. But what you do get is some awesome friends. And we love awesome friends here. Do it, do it, do it. Move it, move it, move it. I should keep up on my Snapchat too. You okay over there? Yeah. Let's see what Crazy Coot's doing. Let's see. What is she doing? Look at her. Look at her. She's stalking the beast. 
That dog's gonna be bigger than her when she gets bigger. She's tempted. She goes down to bed. It. Crikey. Oh no, what is she doing? What is she doing? She's gonna get the dog. Hey! What are you doing with the doggy? What? What? Nothing. I'm I'm a doc doing a documentary on you. She creeps closer, hunkers down, comes eye to eye with the beast. She sits there patiently waiting for her moment. And now, oh God, she's coming! She's coming! Look at the beast. What? Oh! Princess. Princess. Look at her. Tongue out. How scary is she? Just kidding. She's the cutest thing ever. Seriously, I love that dog. My dog, Mac. Our dog Mac had him before Destiny was born, and I love that dog so much. To like the dad when he passed away, it was the saddest thing ever. It was like seriously losing a family member. But then I got Princess. I got another dog, Buddy, but I didn't just didn't have a connection with him. Then I got Princess, and I love Princess. She's awesome. She makes me feel how Mac did. She's a good dog, and she's good with Destiny. I mean, she's a crazy puppy, but. Yeah. yeah, to be honest guys, all puppies are crazy. Like, Mac, I remember Mac when I came home one day and he ate all Destiny's mom's shoes, he ate all the DVDs, and yeah, it's just like a puppy That would be thing. princess, but everything. Yeah, but princess is a puppy too. Mac was a puppy at once, he did the same thing, and you know, he was the best dog in the world when he grew up. I think it's just kind of... Um, it takes time, yeah. Just gotta raise them right, and stuff like that. So let's check the oil. I think you gotta check this pig when it's running, but... <coughs> Operating range, does that mean you check it when it's running? It looks like they grafted two of them together, guys. That's cool. Alright, so means I guess we check it when it's running. Ooh. So that just looks full though to me. So it goes up to about right there or so on this stick. An operating range is about right there, so so she looks full, but I I think operating range, so they want it to be filled up. I mean, I have to look at the thing and see how much force it's going to take. You know what? I have some of this Castrol. GTX Magnatech. This is good oil here. I'm gonna dump some of this in there. The rest of it. There's about a quart in here. Or yeah, it's one something quart. really cool that I want to show you. Because the Subaru took four, huh? I said it's something really cool that I want to show you. What's that? It's in the car. Come on. You gonna jump me? <laughs> I said it's in the car. Come on. Yeah, I heard you. I don't. I just don't want to be killed. Homie, don't play that, okay? You can have all the eight, you can have it all. I don't have anything. Why? You can have all my YouTube winnings. Got her. Got her.
We're gonna get the TV for this thing. Yeah. I know they make a TV for a taco. They must. Yeah, you even. <laughs> Yeah, mm hmm That goes right where that thing goes. But I think in this one, we're going to have to get them in the headrest. Probably because we have that climate control thing right where the TV would go. So we'll probably have to get them in the headrest. <coughs> I got a six sub for this car. Quickly and what? easily. What, babe? When we get the TV, if it does go there, um... Is a way to move it around quickly and easily? Um, yeah, definitely. Sure. I'm not quite sure what you were saying. You have to show me how to move it around. What? Hey, listen, I don't yeah. speak Korean. What? Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Got her! Why? I also got this guy's this fuel treatment, high mileage fuel treatment. So I'm gonna pour that in. I want to take care of this thing. I really like this car. You know, there's a lot of people that dream cars and like the Subaru. I always wanted a Tahoe, man. They are just so cool. Why does it smell like power bait? I sniff everything. I'll taste it too if I have to. Okay, guys, we're gonna check the oil. Let's put half that fuel treatment in. I think just half a tank of gas, so we'll do the rest later. Um, Alright, so this video is gonna get super long, boring, drawn out. Hopefully, you guys think it's funny and fun. Spend time with me and my daughter. Hi, You're a part bye. of our family. You're a part of our family. <laughs> so, bye. like I said, it's always our dream to do YouTube. Destiny's even more than mine. So. Mm -hmm. Alright, say bye. Bye. And we love you, and we'll see you next time.